hey everybody and welcome back to our channel in today's video we are going to show you how to use video editing here in adobe express let's begin now the first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials if this is your first time in adobe express i want you to click the sign up option and from here just to follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go Adobe Express is a great tool for simple and effective video editing. Although your options are quite limited, but your imagination isn't. All right. So if you want to use Adobe Express for video editing, I want you to click the project or the side that you're working. If you haven't already, don't worry because all I have to do is go to the template section, wherein you can search for amazing and thousands of templates where you can begin work for videos right here. So these are going to be some of the options that we can choose from all right so it's up to you all right but if you want to upload your own content and start from there and probably like use that elements for video editing you're welcome to do that as well in my case i'm going to choose the uh, social media which is i'm going to create a simple social media posting with a video stuff right maybe i'm gonna go to the videos again and choose something like okay so i'm going to use this as an example all right so going to the first um timeline here go to click the layer so i can see what layers i'm going to edit all right so the first one is going to be around here all right let's click the timeline so you would notice the sections wherein we can edit the video for example the first one has this i'm going to edit this as g plus and i'm going to change the font style because it's hard to read maybe even how about this one right here yeah it's full of color i'm going to change the uh outline thickness right here there you go and the uh the title will be something like that now for you to add more editing here in this section you see it was um the uh, video were split in different segments right so one runs from four seconds the other runs for nine seconds right here okay so we're going to edit this whole this one right here all right so that's that try to click on play to see what we got here all right and of course you can add more elements right so um basically in the left side panel of your dashboard you see you have the media wherein you can drag and drop more elements like photos music and elements right here we're going to add a music by going to the media section go to audio and put for example any um impeccable audio that you want to add here for example afternoon blues i'm going to add it here right just for that or add audio if you want turn in blues you can of course make it a bit smaller so that we have a different order for the next one and we can add in like a fade in and fade out we can put in the duration if you wanted so we kind of like have the uh, a different effect all right and of course you can select a layer to adjust timing right here right the three dots icon is if you wanted to duplicate a specific scene at, at, at the last part, you can do that, right? And if, for example, you don't want the duplicate already, just click the uh, three dots again and delete the scene, all right? Now, you would notice that the uh, options give you apply duration to all because that is the transitions. If you want to apply duration to all, you might want to click the uh, this, all right? or undo that by pressing ctrl plus z because you also have an option here 
to hide layer timing, which is this one. But if you want to show the timing, click this slider right here. All right, so you would, you would notice that. We're going to add a media. This one, I have added my own thumbnail. Let's see if that blends well together. All right. Nice. I like it. So once you are happy with the uh, elements blended together and you have created a basic video edited um, information here, because Adobe Express is designed for beginners and non-designers. It's intuitive drag and drop interface, making it easy to edit videos without prior experience. Now, if you want to uh, edit some complex videos, you might want to use some other application like Adobe Premiere Pro. But if you're just wanted for simple projects, Adobe Express is perfect for that. So once you are happy with this, right, I want you to go to the upper right corner where you can see the download button. You have the options to the file format. Would you save it as an MP4, PNG, JPEG, or PDF? And of course, for the video resolution, you can opt for the uh, optimal file size, which is going to be 4K. And from here, all I have to do is download. But if you wanted to download a draft for that, you might want to choose for a 720. So it's a lot easier to download and send it to your client or to your boss. Now, if you want to send that to your client, just click on the share button. You have the option to copy link and you have these options. Would you put the settings to only invited people can access or anyone with the link? So whatever you choose, you have an option here for they can comment or can edit. Copy that link and send it to your client or boss or if you're working with multiple freelancers. Now, if you want to save a copy of it to your cloud, you might want to choose any of the following format. Google Drive, OneDrive, Dropbox, and of course, you can also share this to your social media channels like Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, um, Snapchat, and a lot more, or WhatsApp. And so you have all these options. The idea is that once you access all the uh, adobe's collection of royal free royalty free photos videos and music and icons it eliminates the need for external resources all right it's perfect for creating engaging and multimedia rich content of course again share projects like this uh one to your teammates or clients through the collaboration feature right here allowing for easy edits and down and feedback in real time now we have a separate video on how to add your brand kit feature to keep your logos and colors We'll do that in a, in a very quick, uh, we're going to add the logo here. All right. This is going to be G plans. All right. Let's try to pl to play if that works well, very well. Making, um, the, your brand consistent within the video. And that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you again in the next one.